This is the last chance we're giving him. Steven. Tessian. Kira. Romelo. Okay then. Tessian. We went to your house today and found this. Hid in the back of your closet. Whose is it? Whose blood is it? Do you have anything you want to tell us now? Uh, um... We were just trying to help us. Us. It's my blouse. My girl house, I'm putting it with our dirty clothes. I'm mine. Hmm. Alright then, we're going to release the rest of you. And keep Kira for more <laughs> questioning. Bathroom, please. Please. Come. Detective Davis. Objection, Your Honor. My daughter is not guilty. Come, we'll come for both the kids. Excuse me, you'll have to leave. Under which condition? Here, condition. The last set. But for wait for my daughter, she and her friend they because that's right to lock her up in the uniform. Miss, ma'am, we just asked him a few questions. Just wait until we finish due process. Ask them the question in front of me, I want hear what you said to them. <laughs> that's not how it works. They're not how it works, Papa. Tell me how it works now. Miss, just tell me how it works. Miss. Yes, how does it work? You mean for tell me say take up four kids from school, carry them to the police station, questioning them without a lawyer nor them parents? And who are you? Gonzalez. Charles Gonzalez. And Romelo is my son. I know Jamaican police like to break the law and make it seem like they must search for justice. You know what I mean? I know you have a little bit of training in you. And I know that you know what you're doing is wrong. Sir, please release my nephew and his kids right now not only will you lose your job but you see the box that you call a car or the shack that you call a house <laughs> or the mongrel you lay beside you at night that you call a wife will be gone in a twinkle of an eye Miss, these kids are suspects in the disappearance of Ricardo Johnson. And we have reason to believe it could have well have been a murder. What evidence do you have that you could pull these children out of school? The last time Ricky was seen, none of these kids were actually at school and it was a school day. We also found a bloody shirt in one of their rooms. And we have a text message from one of their very, very close friends. Well, a screenshot discussing what well could have been a murder. Mr. Detective, all you have is just a series of conspiracy. I mean, everybody have an old shirt at them, yeah? Mm. If you cut me and my hand start bleeding, the first thing me a jar for is an old shirt to stop the bleeding. True. Mm -hmm. And you're going to tell me, say, all of this based on a screenshot. Come on, man, Mr. Detective. <laughs> Anybody? with a computer nowadays. You can mm -hmm. simply just go on it and edit the picture. F false evidence, fake news. 
What are you trying to say? Mm. But that's not for me and you to decide, you know. They will have their day in court. Yo, we don't have nothing to do with no murder, I'm um, telling you. Achoo! We just only hear say we keep missing. We like pick them with them go on one man. Yeah. Auntie, you know we would never do nothing like that. You have five minutes to release these kids. Or what? Or we get the commission off police on the phone. <laughs> So you think me a joke? Youth yeah. Expression. Talking about you. Talking about you. Talking to you. Talking to you. A youth expression provided by the NFPB. WhatsApp at 536-9154 or call 968-1619. Know the truth, get the facts. Commissioner. What are you doing, sir? See the real gang 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 there. Deal with him. <laughs> Yes, I have um Detective Lawrence. Yeah, the Detective Lawrence from the Kansan Spring Police Station. Yes, yes. Him have my son here locked up with a couple of them friends. Questioning them without a lawyer or them parents. Mm -hmm. Now, Mr. Commissioner, sir, <laughs> I know you're a very principled man. Yeah. But I never expect this kind of behavior from anybody from your team. Yes, sir. Commission, I want to talk to you. Yes, Commissioner Patterson, sir. Detective Lawrence, are you out of your mind? We have reasons to believe that these kids were involved in a murder, sir. Let them go right now. No. What did I say? Yes, sir. No, sir, we just need a look at that. I don't so... want to hear it. Just let them go. Yes, sir. And in the future, you learn to choose your battles. Do you hear me, Detective Lawrence? Yes, sir. You can all go. <laughs> Justice, freedom, free of our kids. Jamaica land we love. Yep, yep, what I'm Jamaica, boom. Jamaica, boom. Lad, officer! Well, I think I'm going to see the guy shoot her, brother. Yeah, baby! Let's see. If you can't shoot her, I'm going to read my mouth, officer. Sabrina. Don't get too comfortable. Just hope so, whatever happened to Ricky, not happened to you. What did you say to me? Oh, if I mess around, police boy. 